Hello everyone, today I'll be doing a, a review of the Lego 40566 Ray the Castaway set. <laughs> this set comes with 256 pieces and took me 30-ish minutes to build. It comes with one minifigure, a little side build which is a raft, and a main island. This island is very similar to the ones found in the Barracuda Bay set, but unlike that set, it uses plates to form the island instead of the special molded pieces here. Apart from that, most of the things in this set are very similar to that set. The palm trees are different, with two different colours instead of the same two different colours in that set. It doesn't have coconuts, and instead of this type of green and a light green, it has that type of green and a dark green. Over here we have some almost new sand green palm leaves, which are only included in one other set. Over here we have the same parrot that was included in the parts of Barracuda Bay set, which is another very similar thing. Down here we have um, SOS, spelled with a life ring and two dead snakes. You also have um, a message in the bottle that's going to be sent out soon, and a crab. Over here we have a little starfish and a fishing rod with a fish on it. Around the back we have the raft which is attached to the actual porch and the little treasure chest. Inside the treasure chest are two little red rubies. They're not anything special but it's nice to have them in the set. I can't them in. Up here we have a little hiker's backpack piece that normally fits on the back of a minifigure, but is attached to the back of Ray's house. At the front we have a tiny step ladder, um, nice railings actually, and the roof. The roof is made of the dead palm tree leaves, which are the well, which are the ones that were included in the one Star Wars set from a while ago. Apart from that, there's not too much special about this set. It's a nice display piece, but it doesn't completely match up with parts of Barracuda Bay because of the palm tree leaves and because of the actual island. Both of those are different, but again, it still has some similarities. I think I would put these two on a shelf together, but I would have to modify this first. For the amount of money you have to spend, it's okay, but some people are selling it for $90 on eBay, which is just too much for the set. I would buy it for uh, $25 at least. It's just a nice set, but it doesn't really have any real features. It's pretty well designed, but nothing really stands out for me. It's just a display piece. Uh, bye everyone, I hope you enjoyed this review. Please leave a like and subscribe.